Hey guys, welcome back. It's AMR here from Hillier Drimline. So this is part four of my four part tutorial on how to buy a new vehicle. If you've watched the other three parts, part one, online search, part two, calling the dealer, part three, visiting the dealer, and the final part to this chapter, picking up the brand new vehicle. Listen to my points, guys. You'll never lose on a new car buy. Let's get started, all right? Point number one, pay the dealer last. No rush to give the, the dealer your check or money. Okay, we're gonna get to those points in a second. Go to your vehicle, be satisfied, all right? Do not pay the vehicle dealer right away, pay him last. Moving on to the next point. You are the king that day. You are the almighty king at the dealership the day you're gonna pick it up. They need you. Today is the final day. No sale is final until the money's in the bank, remember that. So, right away, you go there, you have your coffee, you take your time, you are the king that day, remember. Okay. Also, I tell, like I said, you were the king of the day. You've got over 20 G's in your pocket. Have a free coffee. Ask the dealership for a hat. Ask them for a keychain. Ask them for a water bottle. Hit up your new car salesman or sales manager with everything that day. Squeeze them to the last penny because that's what your day is. Today you're picking up the vehicle. Today's the day they need you, okay? Now moving on. Let's see if we cover any more points. Now, make sure the vehicle is inside for pickup. If the vehicle is outside, everything else is a BS excuse. The dealer is saying, oh, we're busy, this, this, this. If the vehicle's outside, they're hiding something. If the vehicle's inside, the vehicle 99% is ready to rock. If it's outside, they have a minor stone chip imperfection. They don't want you to see. They want you to bypass. If it's winter, even better. It's freezing outside. You don't want to do nothing. You want to give the guy the check and you want to run off. What the heck is the rush? We'll talk about it later. What is the rush? You're picking up the vehicle, it's your day. When that vehicle leaves, you're nobody, remember that. Okay, moving on. Inspect the vehicle. Inspect all the panels, any nicks, scratches, dents. Open the doors, check for any marks of any types of wrenches or any types of other paint runs or anything. Like I said, no, no sale is final until the money's in the bank. Make sure you check your vehicle, any lights on. You're gonna say, hey, we're buying our new vehicle. Believe me guys, I've bought a lot of vehicles over my time and I was just as stupid as you were. I thought, you know what, the dealer is almighty. Here's my check drive off, the alignment would be off, there'd be a wheel balance issue, there'd be a nick in the paint. Even some panels were painted. When I got home, I discovered that. The dealer said, oh, you know what, someone in the parking lot had nicked the door, we got it painted. How do I know that? How do I know that door wasn't smashed and you guys fixed it? If the door's painted, it doesn't matter if it's a stone chip or the vehicle, half the side was taken off. It's painted, you're buying a new vehicle, you're not buying a hit vehicle inspect every panel. Take your time, there's no rush. You can still back out that day. You left the dealer 500 deposit. You can take your $20,000 check and say, you know what? This has been painted, I don't want this crap. Take it and go. So that's what you gotta do. Next thing is, have fun with the salesman. Like I said, you're the king with that day. Poke at him, have fun, tell jokes, have a good time. Bother the new car sales manager, you're the king that day. Until you hand over the check, when you hand over the check, remember, you're nobody after that. Okay, and another point, pretty much the final point is gonna be, now they're gonna ask you for all the new car stuff. Do you want Scotch card? Do you want wax? Do you want auto star? Do you want window tinting? Some people want that, some people don't. All right, don't waste your time, only buy what you need. If you need something, get it done, all right, ladies and gentlemen? So that pretty much sums up the last part of this tutorial on picking up the vehicle. Have a good time, you're the king of the day. Take your time, inspect. Once you're satisfied, I'm not saying take every bolt off and inspect it, you can only do so much. Give them the check and also check the car proof. Have a good time, enjoy your new vehicle. I hope this four part tutorial helps you in purchasing a new vehicle from beginning to end. And even this can apply to a used vehicle. This can even apply to a motorcycle or a motorhome. It's the same concept no matter where you are in the world, whether you're buying a Rolls Royce or whether you're buying a Chevy Spark. Thanks for watching this AMR from Hillier Drimlines. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter at Hillier Drimlines. My personal account at AMR Sierra. Thank you guys. We're good to wrap.